is up hustle babes today is february 16th it is currently 1 14 p.m and i was actually supposed to get my day started like three and a half ish hours ago so y'all i'm a little late but today is a very exciting yet busy day because we're juggling some work while i prep for my bachelorette trip okay i'm gonna give y'all details on where i'm going all of that stuff like later on in the video but today we have so much on the agenda i have to get a wax go to the hair store go to Target, of course. I need to get a COVID test somehow. I have to go to Marshalls. I got a full list of things to do, okay? So we have to go because I was supposed to leave at 9.30 and it's one o'clock. How did that happen? Absolutely no clue. So let's go like right now. <laughs> baby, baby, girl, you got it. baby, I'm back in stop is the hair store i'm like all out of order today i was actually supposed to go get my covid test first but that was if i started my day at nine so because the wax place is in this vicinity i'm gonna go run into the hair store and it's 143 right now if i have some time i'm gonna run to rainbow because I'm, I'm gonna put y'all on rainbow in a second but let me run into this hair store because i need to grab some lashes some lash glue and I think that's it. Just lashes and lash glue. I don't want to get too carried away in there. So let me go in and get out. <laughs> A few moments later. I'm going to show y'all the lashes that I got from the beauty supply store before I run into Rainbow. So I got these right here. I always get this brand, I Envy. And I got the number five as well as I got two number fives. And then I got two of these number threes. The number threes are giving me more like every day. So like when I'm going to like the beach or something like that, I'm gonna wear these because they're a little relaxed. It looks like I'm not doing too much. Or even when I don't put on makeup, I'll probably put these on because I don't get like single lashes anymore. I don't know if I'm gonna get them for my wedding or not. It honestly depends when I do my makeup trial, then I'll decide. But anyway, and then I got one of these, so I get these in Rich Peach. These are real drama. These are usually like my, I'm dressing up, going out to dinner type of lash. So, and this is by V Lux by IMV. I didn't even realize that. So IMV actually makes both of these brands, which is probably why I like them. I like 20 to 25 mm, but then I also like lashes like that have kind of like a little space in them, but kind of have that long, short look instead of all together looking kind of like butter butterfly-ish I don't like that so if you see like literally all of them have like that long short look which is hilarious and then I'm trying black eyelash glue for the first time I usually get clear but then I find myself feeling like I could have put on eyeliner so I think wearing black eyelash glue would give me like an eyeliner look but anyway I'm about to go into rainbow and I'm gonna put y'all up on game because I always go to Rainbow for like bras and underwear because they always have sales on all their bras and underwear and they have specialty bras. Like they have like deep cut V's, clear back bras, like all that type of crazy stuff. So I love going to Rainbow to get me some bras and some underwears, especially when I just need it to wear it like just a couple times. It's not something that I'm really looking to keep forever. And even then, I think I have like a Rainbow bra that I've had for like over two years, honestly. So, you know, it is what it is. So I'm going to go into Rainbow real quick. It's 209. And the wax place is two minutes from here. So I'm thinking I could run into Rainbow, boop, boop, get out, and then drive there. So let's go. I'm about to get waxed for the first time in years like the last time i got waxed was in 2018 and we are in 2022 so that's four years y'all well i get my face waxed all the time because like i have these chin neck ears and then i usually get sideburns but i think i shaved them off recently i've been breaking out y'all i'm stressed wedding playing stuff so don't judge me but yeah i do get my face waxed and stuff but as far as anywhere else i don't get it waxed so 
this is gonna be interesting. <laughs> very, very interesting. I literally don't want to do that ever again. <laughs> and I think this is what happened in 2018 and why I didn't do it. But this time I did sugar for like sensitive areas and I did plain wax for like my face and stuff because I get a wax on my face like often actually, like whenever I get my nails done. So my face was actually the least painful part. I actually teared up a little bit, y'all. It was a lot, um, but as you can see, you can see like my chin hairs are gone from before. I'll put like it on the side of the screen. Well, so y'all can compare before and after my little chi sideburns. And you can see like my lip area very clear, pretty much. I kind of have like a bump right here from it, but I'm exfoliating stuff and do my whole face routine when I get home, so it'll clear up. I'm about to hop real quick to Marshall's and then we finna take this long drive to Best Buy. So let's go to Marshall's real quick because it's 324 and I wanna be home by five. I wanted to be home by three, but I left three and a half hours late. So obviously I wouldn't be home by five. So got like an hour and a half and I'm very hungry and I'm trying to ignore it. So that way I could just knock everything out. traffic so I decided I'm gonna just well I haven't really told y'all what I'm actually getting ready for I just realized right so <laughs> I actually am going out of town for my bachelorette my bachelorette festivity starts on Thursday in Miami I've never really turned up in Miami because I grew up in Miami and so I was just worried about school and stuff back then so this is gonna be like one of my only times ever turning up in Miami so we're doing a little something bachelorette night is what it's called and so majority of bride tribe is gonna be there bachelorette night so i'm having like a bachelorette night and a trip in one so we get to like basically meet up and stuff and fly out together which is something i've always wanted to do like i always want to do that with group trips because i just feel like it adds to the energy because when you're when you fly in different times and all this stuff and you're landing in this foreign place separately you will be a little reserved and then you gotta warm up, especially when it's people who don't like all know each other. So being able to have like the night before and you kind of get all those nerves and stuff out the way and then we go into the place together, I feel like that's way better, like in my opinion. I'm headed to Miami and then my bachelorette trip is actually in DR. So DR is a place that I've went to a ton of times. I don't want to jinx anything, but I love going to DR, okay? So today I'm pretty much running around doing everything for it because my flight is tomorrow. Basically as soon as it hits noon. Like it's at 1.11, but I gotta be there. Probably like noon-ish. Right now I am trying to go to Best Buy, but I'm gonna stop by and get something to eat because I'm starving. So I was in Miami, not last weekend, but the weekend before. And I went down there to do like my bridal hair trial, to do a food tasting, a cupcake tasting, a whole bunch of stuff in one. And I flew back to Atlanta for an event and I flew back to Miami. Like this is a day after each other. So like Friday, like Thursday, I flew to Miami. Friday, I had all this stuff to do. Friday night, I flew back to Atlanta, which my flight ended up getting canceled, delayed, it was a whole lot. Flew back to Atlanta, came here Saturday morning, had the event that day, and then flew back Sunday morning for my bridal shower that was that day. Y'all, it was so much, but pretty much on the Friday, so I had the intention of vlogging that entire weekend. And let me tell y'all how on the Friday we pull up to the food tasting. It's me, my parents, Andy, his parents, one of our friends, and then one of our friends again and another part, like another person basically that's a part of our wedding party and it's also one of our friends. So it's all of us there. We walk in to the, like they had set up this little room and this table with wine glasses, all this stuff. Cause I guess they were trying to be real fancy, which you know is appreciated cause we paid a pretty penny for it. but. So we pull up and I'm pulling out my camera to like get shots and record all the food and do all this other stuff. And let me tell you how my camera fell off the stick, y'all. I was so mad because my stick had been acting up a little bit, but it's never to the point where my camera literally 
did like a somersault, hit the ground, and the lens is what broke. So I wasn't even able to turn on my camera and really use it because the lens was like flickering, like kind of like, you know how they do like flashing lights that can like trigger, um, what's the word? They can trigger like epilepsy and stuff like that. Imagine not flashing lights, but a flashing lens. Hold on, somebody's calling me, y'all. to come to target with no list i'm over here trying to figure out what i need i have like a bunch of little bottles and jars and stuff at home and i have bought a whole bunch of stuff for like my shower routine like 300 worth of stuff so i'm definitely gonna put that stuff to use and package it up <laughs> in my little bottle stuff but i'm trying to figure out what i need need so i grabbed toothpaste look at my hair sticking up i grabbed toothpaste and deodorant and baby wipes that's all I could think of because I don't need to shave or anything like that. I should grab some lady stuff just in case. But yeah, I'm going to do that and then some cotton swabs and I'll get out of here because I've been in Target literally just talking on the phone, which I'm happy because it distracted me from buying stuff. But like, I did pick up a couple of bras and underwear and this thing, even though I feel like I have this already at home, I just don't know where it's at. And then I got these two um, curling iron thingies. So I think that's all I'm getting today from Target because I need to go home. It is now 9.02. I made it home around like eight something. Um, but I have to redo this intro video to my launch course because technology just never acts right when you put something great together to be completely honest. So I'm about to re-record that and then put it up so that way everyone can be able to start their course. And then I'm gonna eat because your girl is hungry and all I had was french fries and grapefruit today, okay? So I'm about to do work for just a little bit and then head downstairs. y'all so it is the next day it is currently thursday february 17th um and it's about 10 27. i don't know why i didn't think to do my nails yesterday because my call actually was canceled yesterday and i could have did my nails last night but i didn't so now i'm going to do my nails in miami because i just don't have the time to do them up here because it's 10 27 and my goal was to get there at 10 but i didn't pack last night either so i'm about to pack right now <laughs> I'm about to show y'all all these packages that I have. So let me take y'all downstairs because it literally looks like a warehouse. And look, there's another package that got delivered overnight. <laughs> let me show y'all all the packages that we have because this right here is a lot for me to go through. This is what our front room looks like. Ignore my dog. But literally these are like things that I bought yesterday, Target, Rainbow, all that stuff. All of these are like Amazon packages and stuff. And then more stuff over here blended in with like, I think I got this for my bridal shower as a bridal shower gift. This was also like stuff that I'm packing for my bridal shower and just a bag in general. And then this right here, I think is a suitcase that I had on my bridal shower registry that my mom got me. So I'm about to open this first because obviously I need the suitcase first. And then I'm gonna go through all of these packages. I tried on everything in here, but I didn't try on everything in my Fashion Nova package or the shoe and something else. And two bathing suits that I got in my Amazon package I need to try on just to make sure to see if I need to pack like a backup. Um, but yeah, I'm about to open this, take that upstairs and then start packing. <laughs> Like, look at that the little rose gold embellishments on it and it's kind of like a cool shape on it 
so cute i love it but i'm about to get to packing y'all and i'm not gonna do too much talking so oh my god look at my bump i'm breaking out again it is 205 and i'm still here my flight was actually at 111 i made it there in time to catch the flight because i have claire and stuff but i keep forgetting that i had a check bag today because normally when i travel it's real quick so i do like a carry-on yeah i forgot so I missed the drop for my check bag. So now my flight's at 445. So I'm gonna go get my nails done right now. I just ate breakfast and then hopefully UPS cause I have a package that still didn't get delivered and it's pissing me off because it's from Saks and it should have been here by now, but they didn't ship it till late even though I pay for two day shipping. So just in case I don't come back on this vlog, I'm gonna go ahead and close out this vlog because I'm gonna start a new one because tonight is Thursday. I mean, today is Thursday and tonight is actually my bachelorette night. And then I leave in the morning for my bachelorette trip. So I'm gonna try to vlog as much as I can of bachelorette night. I don't really know where that's gonna get me to be completely honest cause I don't Want to put certain things on youtube and youtube don't want me to put certain things on youtube i'm sure if anything i'll vlog the trip because that's you know easy breezy but i'll try to include anything that i can from tonight um but yeah just in case i don't come back on that's the end of today's vlog it was very hectic if y'all think it was hectic watching it like just look at my hair okay this tells you how my day is going so <laughs> i'll see y'all later if i don't see y'all again peace